transmission thermostat and external cooler. Again, doing 80 mile an hour on a 90 degree day. A lot more elevation change on this particular route. So I've been keeping her in and out of lockup just to see what happens. I've been driving for about 35 miles now. And I have not seen the pan exceed 197. And then it immediately drops back down to 194-ish, 193-ish once we get back into lockup. So as you can see, torque converter temp and trans temp at speed for prolonged amounts of time. The same weather, more adverse conditions and loading. In fact, I'm probably about a quart low on fluid because I have not added the additional fluid and you lose a little bit when you take things apart, put them back together. I'm going to change the fluid this afternoon when I get back, but I had to go to work, do a few things. So when I get back home and it cools off this evening, go ahead and do a fluid exchange and make sure I've added the correct amount of fluid. But even a quart low, 193, baby, at the paint. We were running 213 yesterday by this point. Actually, I hadn't even driven this far yesterday or on hills, so I bet I would have been more like 218, 220. So we're talking about a 23, 24, 25 degree difference without towing. And let me tell you, that fluid that I did capture in a water bottle when I was uh, taking the warmer off to put the thermostat plate on was nasty at 40,000 miles. This truck is a 19, and it has almost exactly 40,000 miles as of yesterday on the original fluid. And uh, don't kid yourself, change your fluid. 